So that man has involved in many non-profit making movements in the country. And out of that largely a campaign against female feticide and roco cancer, a campaign for awareness of cancer are the prestigious uh, campaigns where man is actually involved. Man has joined the Bharatiya Janata Party in 2009 and she has been a very strong admirer of uh, our Prime Minister Narendra Modi before in fact she actually won the uh, seat and uh, from that day onwards she saw something which we all saw at a later stage. Ma'am, thank you very much for uh, admiring. Yeah, thank you. And uh, ma'am won from Chandigarh the member parliament in 2014 with a huge margin and because of her work for the city beautiful, the citizen of uh, Chandigarh again chose ma'am as the member parliament in 2019 again with a huge margin. You will also be happy to know that Anupam Kher Foundation also runs a program called APA which works for the children who are derived of the joy of life on account of serious diseases. With this background, let me ask the activity council of the ICANN, the national body, to approach ma'am and Mr. Anupam K to be your uh, brand ambassador for the country if everybody is sitting in this hall. Knows ma'am, so that way ma'am does not need any introduction because the all delegates ma'am, they are from the India. They will push special school. And every time Anupam would go to work, he would wonder what it's about. He would look that side and you know be be interested. And one day he decided to just go in there. He went in there and he was met by some nuns. And one of them when they took him to the senior nun and he realized that it was a school being run for children with special needs. And uh, most of them were mentally challenged and uh, he wanted to to spend time with them once a week because he was a, at a very busy stage in his career and he was doing three shifts in a day shooting for different films but he he and the, the principal of Dilkush decided that every Wednesday morning he would come there and spend some time and he continued to do it for years and years and years. So much so that he and Sister Dolores, who was the principal of that school, became very, very close. And after Sister Dolores retired, I think she was from Czechoslovakia or Poland or somewhere, it changed hands. And uh, Alpham was not very comfortable going there. Us. They remember people, they identify people, they show great affection, they show when they're upset, when they're emotionally upset, they're transparent, they're beautiful in that way. Zindagi bahut sari chalakiya sikha deti hai, ek yehi to log reh gaye hai, jo ye bachche, jo itne transparent hai, ki har cheez unke chahre pe aajati. I think it is extremely important even if some ch children who are not mentally challenged, to pay attention to the mental health of adolescents and children. Unfortunately, we don't yet have the kind of uh, things in place that I feel are very necessary in schools. Like Dr. Saar, Dr. Chavan and I were talking, that we need counselors in our schools. And I'm going to put it to the governor that Every school needs a counsellor or in case they can't have it for every school, at least two or three schools can be clubbed to have a counsellor. 